Hola. Okay, so I did a video um a couple weeks back about <clears throat> an apartment that I just got. And um this is my new Hecate altar. Hecate altar. Um this is a beautiful goddess Hecate, queen of witches and um dark spirits and spirits um of the underworld and of the night. And this is her cake and her incense. And this is my spider oil that I keep that actually glows. That actually glows. And then, oops. And this is my lovely Caldero. This is my new Athame that I just got. It's a samurai. And this is the bell that I use when I do ritual. This is um, a death walking oil that I just made out of uh, graveyard grass, and I will share the story on that. Actually, what I did was I went to a graveyard here in my local my city, and um, I left coins for the for the uh, gatekeeper, the uh, whether you call it La Santissima, um, I don't refer to it as that. I I call it the gatekeeper, and. Um, so I, I pulled grass from the outline of the property and some mud and I made an oil out of it and that is death walking oil that I use. And this is my lovely money money uh, rice. <coughs> my lovely money rice. And so I'll show some sigils that I'm using. That's an invocation symbol to ground down the energies that I use with Hecate. This is my lovely tapestry. And I'll take you over here to my beautiful white roses. And um, these are giant roses, actually. Look at look at this. Look at the size of my hand, and then look at these roses. It's so beautiful. And this is um, the door to my bathroom. I don't let people in my space. It's very protected. Um, <clears throat> I don't let people in my home, really. Because it's very personal, and it was more like a gift from a friend. And this is another athame that I'm using. This is a statuette of Diana, um, the goddess of light and of hunting and wild animals and deer and fertility and chastity. And this is my uh, barang, or Vietnamese statue. And um, that's a coffee ritual that I did. And it's more Javanese. And this is my lovely fireplace that somebody gifted me. And this is just some green tea. That's my TV. Don't worry about it. Um, that's, you'll see that in the video if you watch my uh, channel. And this is my the besom that I use. Some of the besom that I use in around. What some vanilla here? my uh food dog lion reminds me of my ex-husband yes some herbs some kitchen spices that i use um of course i have to show the lion statue the lion in the land because well hecate was queen of shepherds as well and she was also queen of lions or ferocity and this is my lovely uh tiki I believe that's cool. I'm not sure if that's cool, but I believe it is. Um, and if you ever hear the story of the tiki chasm or the doorway to uh, the other side or um, the tikis that uh, surround Polynesia and Tahiti and um, Hawaii and Micronesia, then you'll find the story of the tikis that came um, from our land ancestors. This is another sigil, triple moon sigil. This is my bed. It's filled with blankets because it's close to Valentine's Day. And um, here's my demon chaser. It sits right above my bed. It would typically go out in the living room, but I just, I brought it in here to protect my bed while I sleep. And then this is my dream catcher. And this is my lovely uh, sun catcher. And that's my closet right over there. That's my closet. Isn't, isn't that, isn't that nice? I don't know what to say about it, but it's, it, it's to symbolize um, some stuff for me. It can be but yeah, this is my room. So um, this is my new witchy space. And uh, with that, I hope everybody shares theirs. Every, all upcoming witches and practitioners of spirituality, uh, la espiritismo, or candomble, or uh, yumbanda, or whatever the case is, whether it's traditional witchcraft, 
Excuse me, let me shut this TV up. Any blow that you're concerned about to the head should be checked out. It's that simple. I uh, can tell you that we have folks that or, uh, go to the bathroom and they hit the head on the edge of who the Who practice the La Candomble, which I'll be taking care of, or uh, La Umbanda, then... um. My room would very much interest you. Yeah, my white roses, I kind of tried to show everybody around. There's rose petals all over my floor right now. <clears throat> There's herbs everywhere. And I'll show what I've been eating too. But I'm going to take you back over here to the lovely goddess Hecate. Mother of lions, mother of witches. And um, this is her statue. And I will be doing a ritual with her. And you will be seeing how I use um, that statue. And I will also be doing a um, very nice video on the god Triton of the sea. And his um, his particular daemon or uh, titans or whatever. Well, they wouldn't be considered titans or daemon. But they would be considered uh, spirits of the sea. So um, I'll take you back and show you this wonderful athame that's here. The samurai's Japanese atome that protects my space. All right, so with that, I hope everybody's um, Valentine's Day is absolutely blessed. And um, holy love and light, sacredness, blessed be.